Hey folks, my name's Aaron, and I was going to show you, I have a little kid's go-kart. It's a Hamilton go-kart, and uh, I've installed a Predator 212 engine from Harbor Freight. Now, the engine, the gas tank, would not fit uh, due to the cart's length. So what I ended up doing was just removing the gas tank and installed a fuel pump as you can see right here just a pulse pump uh, just probably about a $15 part uh, I used the vacuum from the engine on the valve cover I just installed the hose from there to the pump for vacuum and Ended up using just an old five gallon gas tank that I had laying around in my garage that the spout broke on. So, I'll show you what I did here. I actually bought uh, with the pulse pump, I had a fuel filter. So, I ended up putting the fuel line onto the fuel filter and just setting it down in the end of the gas tank. This worked out wonderful. I uh, didn't know that it would actually work out until I tried it. Uh, it fits on just perfect. It's cheap, it works well. Uh, the fuel filter sits right down in the end of the gas tank. And I just strapped it on uh, just using a regular strap. And it's great. It works perfect. It sticks on there just fine. And it runs well. Uh, these little 212 engines, you can't beat them for power. Starts up good. Purrs like a kitten. Um, but yeah, this is a great cheap way to install a gas tank on a cart that wasn't made for a Predator engine. So, yeah, that's about it. Uh, little kid loves it. It pulls me just great up steep hills and no problem. All right, y'all have a wonderful day.